Hey, good morning, guys. It's Pastor Steve here. It's Ugly Christmas Sweater Sunday, so I've got my uh, ugly sweater on, and actually, I can even make it flash. Look at that. That's pretty darn cool. I hope you're having fun getting ready to celebrate Christmas. I think that is probably the toughest thing about December. When December gets here, we're like, oh, man, Christmas is almost here, and then we have to wait. We have to wait. I hate waiting. I don't know about you. I hate waiting. Maybe uh, you've had to wait for a birthday before, or maybe you're waiting for Christmas and the presents that are going to be there. Maybe you've had a a, a mom or dad or or grandparents say, hey, you know what? If you clean up your room, we can go out for ice cream. And you're like, oh, man, I don't want to have to clean up my room. But you really want ice cream, so you have to figure out how to make that all work, right? But you trust that if you clean up your room, your your parents or grandparents will take you out. Maybe uh, you go to Culver's and get some custard. That's the best. You know, in our Bible story today, we're looking at the the story of Hannah, a woman who really wanted to have a baby and she asked God to to give her a baby and and she struggled and she waited and she waited and she really wanted that. And then finally God tells her, yes, you know what, Hannah, you're going to be able to have a baby. And she's overjoyed because God is faithful and and she she struggles in, in the waiting time. But eventually she has a baby boy named Samuel who ends up serving the Lord and doing some awesome and amazing things that you can read about in the Bible. The promising for for us as as believers in Jesus is that God promised to to give us a gift. And and here you can see in in the manger scene, we have have baby Jesus there. That gift and people had to wait for it and wait for it. And and the star told the, the wise men to come and worship and praise God and the king that's there. And we can't wait to celebrate Christmas. But imagine having to wait and wait. Sure enough that Jesus is going to come We get to celebrate Christmas. It's going to be awesome. And until that time, we've got five, six, six more days till Christmas. We have to wait. But I know you can do it as we trust that our God is faithful and he will give us his promise. He will fulfill it. He does it every single time. And because of his great love for us, he sent Jesus to this earth at Christmas. I hope you have a great time celebrating that and the waiting is not too hard. Hey, would you guys pray with me? Let's pray. Gracious Heavenly Father, thank you so much for your great love. Thank you for the gifts and your faithfulness, the way that you fulfill all of your promises. Help us to trust in you, that you will be with us wherever we go, whatever we do, and that you would help us to have a great Christmas. Help us to tell others that great and good news of your love that is found in a manger at Christmas. We just pray this all in Jesus' name and all God's people say, amen. Awesome, guys. Hey, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys later. I'm going to keep getting ready for Christmas. Yay!